City officers raided the home of Sherry Lynn Ferguson on Main Street in Paintsville early this morning, a home that sits only a few blocks from the police department and city hall. They came away from that bust with substantial results. Well, the Paintsville uh, Police Department uh, got some anonymous tips uh, on some drug use, and we made a very substantial raid uh, last night and uh, raided our city of some dangerous drugs that were out on the street, and we're going to continue to do so. Do you worry about having enough money to last throughout retirement? Give Reed Potter at Raymond James a call. Reed has 26 years experience helping folks enjoy their best life in their retirement years. Confiscated along with the drugs and drug paraphernalia was a food stamp card, which police say Ferguson was allegedly accepting for purchasing various drugs. This was on Main Street uh, in a house that we had got a tip on. Uh, we had done some surveillance and we chose the right time, uh, made the right decision, and made a major drug bust. Runyon and his police department say this arrest and drug seizure will be the first of many. It's actually been ongoing for a long time. Uh, as you know, when you do things like this, it takes time and it takes patience. So we're going to continue to ramp up as much as we possibly can because we do not want dangerous drugs on the streets of the city of Paintsville. All told, police seized about 300 grams of meth, numerous gabapentin pills, and $5,000 in cash along with scales and other paraphernalia. Ferguson was charged with trafficking in a controlled substance within 1,000 feet of a school and third degree trafficking in a controlled substance. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Sheldon Compton.